Thomas and Friends. Beer battered engine, one day, Duck was at the soda brewery. Beer was being loaded into his trucks, the work took a long time, the brewers were using old equipment and Duck was worried, I'm going to be late for Gordon at the docks, he won't like this, please hurry up and, Duck was rudely interrupted, his driver and fireman laughed, oh, cried Duck, that beer is so cold, he was impressed when they were speeding along the town run, then, they saw a man waving a red flag, what's the matter now? Fallen trees have blocked the tracks, reported the man. I've marked the spot, we'll go and inspect, said the driver. It would be dangerous for heavy engines like Gordon, agreed the driver, but for Duck, it's safe enough. The guard left a red oil lamp by the damaged track to warn engines. When we get to the docks, I'll tell them to close the line. Gordon was waiting for Duck's trucks. Fwa, you're late. And that beer is making me cold and ill. I can't help it, it's the beer, replied Duck, and there's danger on the rails, that's why we're late, huh, you're the only danger on the rails, Duck, now, stop wasting time, and get your trucks hitched to my train, Duck's driver and fireman were in the yard master's office when they heard Gordon's whistle, he was steaming out of the station with his long heavy train of beer, what route is Gordon taking tonight, asked the driver, the town run, it's the quickest. But I told you, that's dangerous for a big engine like Gordon, the yard master quickly phoned the signal man. Gordon roared past the signal box, I'll soon make up for lost time. The signal man was answering the telephone but couldn't hear the warning, by the time he did, Gordon was far away in a cloud of steam, but when Gordon reached the town track, his hopes for a fast run were dashed, fog floated everywhere, I can't see, cried Gordon. Nor could his driver, and when he could, it was too late. As soon as he saw the fallen trees, Gordon was unable to stop, plowing straight into the trees. The beer trucks were all smashed and the beer splashed everywhere. Onjins don't drink beer Gordon, you were meant to be collecting the beer not drink it. Said the fat controller, you should know by now. Yes sir. I'm sorry sir. When Gordon arrived at the docks. Cranky the crane looked down on him, my, my, Gordon, I expect you'll have beer drinking tales to tell, but take my advice, have a long hose down first. Pa! hissed Gordon. But there was worse to come, look, said a child. It's that blue express engine who drank beer instead of delivering it. Engines don't drink beer. They only drink from water towers. Gordon was much more cross, Duck felt sorry for Gordon, come on, your driver says it's time for a nice washdown, then you'll feel much better. And Gordon did, I'm sorry I was rude to you Duck. That's alright, but can you smell something? What? You're not smelling like beer anymore. Oh yes. Replied Gordon. 